the Winter Olympics just two days away. And more evidence this morning, though, that Sochi is not ready for thousands of journalists that are arriving for the games. They are appalled by the condition of their hotel room. Some of this year's biggest stories coming out of the Winter Olympics had nothing to do with the athletes or their performances. It was actually stories of journalists that were making the headlines. As journalists arrived to half-finished hotel rooms, they turned to Twitter to complain about their bad experiences. The Sochi Problems hashtag popped up, and within days, it had been used over a half million times. Right away, Airbnb seized the opportunity for a little real-time marketing and started with a post about the 500 listings available in Sochi. And when journalists complained, Airbnb was there to rescue them. Broken doorknobs? Sounds like a deal breaker to us. Take a vacation from your hotel. Yahoo Sports columnist Dan Wetzel also had doorknob problems. To anyone in Sochi, I'm now in possession of three light bulbs. We'll trade for a door handle. This offer is real. Hey, Dan Wetzel, trade you three spare light bulbs for a spare bedroom. We'll even throw in a door handle. National Post sports columnist Bruce Arthur also complained. Miss you, hot water in my hotel. You were great. Hey, Bruce Arthur, we found your hot water and it has new friends. A heated towel rack and a cozy apartment. And when the games were over, Airbnb seemed to be one of the biggest sponsors at the Olympics. All without sponsoring anything.